It was severe damage. There we go. That's it. We got him. Okay. That is him gone. And this time he might have us unless we can do that sharp turn. We might be okay. Woo! Whee! Nice. Now we've got the other one to worry about. Oh, 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 oh. Welcome everyone, it is good to be back, and we are back with what else but Ultimate Admirals Dreadnought. And we're going to continue our campaign as the Germans as we've been playing, and see where it all leads after an absolutely amazing battle in the last episode, where we had a huge battle, we were very, very, well, we absolutely smashed them to be honest, and we came out on top, and you can see by our victory points, we are very, very well on our way to doing quite well. We are bleeding though, we are bleeding a hell of a lot of money. Uh, we've got a bigger fleet, uh, but the German Empire is struggling to pay for it. So we'll see how long we last, but after our first, next, after our turn, we are now have another battle to fight. This one here, I'm not going to really show you because it's pretty straightforward. We're going to go in and go out, but there is, we've been attacked down here with a... Heavy and a light cruiser against a heavy and light. We've got one torpedo boat, but they're up against our transports. So we're going to go in there and see if we can protect our transports. So let's get on with the show. But thank you all for supporting and, and watching the series. It's been an absolutely joy um, to play this one. Uh, absolutely loving this naval battle simulator. All right, here we go. So our aim here is to use this torpedo boat to put some holes in the side of them before our vulnerable cruisers come through. Now it's one of my least favorite ones, so I really don't mind if these uh, sink. Should mothball them actually or scrap them because they're totally useless. Alrighty, and we are going to go, he's aiming for our cruiser, Hertha. Now is that the light, that is the pure, that could be the heavy actually. So let's. And back around. You're going to torp yourself right there. Be able to scrap in there. Beautiful. This looks good. This looks very good. No, gonna miss. Let's get out of there. First miss. We've only got one torp left. And this time he might have us, unless we can do that sharp turn. We might be okay. Woo! Whee! Nice. Now we've got the other one to worry about. Oh, 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 oh. So if we can do it this time. He's gonna get hit. He's gonna get hit. He's gonna get hit. We might lose that torpedo boat, so that was uh, short-lived. Alright. So you don't have any torps left. You've got one torp left. Let's chase down the light cruiser first. Oh, you're not going to go there, are you? Oh, you'll be fine. I'll watch the torp there. To the aim up there. You're gonna aim there. OK. 
Come on. Don't hit them at all yet. Alright, we've got a hit. Nice. Come up behind him. Stay out of his torp range, so let's stay here. You probably want to come out there. So you will go out. He's dead in the water. It is back up. Now go, 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 go. Get out of there. You can still run. We've lost one of our rear guns on that, but he might be able to still take a few pot shots while he makes a run. He's making a run as well. We've got... What have we got speeds wise? They're very fast. 17. Well, he's got pretty much full speed now. Except for now, another... Okay, here we go. Good. Another light hit. Come on, come on, you can get out. Nice. Come on, you've got the close range now. You're in torp range as well. it speed up again pump that water out we've got a bit light engine damage but we've got enough speed to probably get out as long as he doesn't land another any more shots come on engine damage oh it's doing all right slowing down yes this could be him nearly gone another shot off would be nice Pumping the water back out. And he's slightly damaged, which is good. Very good. 
Let's go, another shot. We should be able to get another shot off before we turn. You missed. Let's go in on a slight angle. Pretty evenly matched, except, uh, well, now that we lost our torque boat, which we lost pretty quickly. They too take a pound in these uh, light cruisers, or this class. It's just that they've got no real firepower, but he's proven a bit of a bother since to Natal. If we can come around, with, by the time we move around here, we'll sink, hopefully, this light cruiser. Then we'll come up the rear of Natal and we should be able to, hopefully, shell him a little. Ooh. Alright, he's got some speed back, so he's got one of his engines back. So far, so good. So far. Let's see if we can light him up. Come on. Come on. Come on, he's doing some light damage to you. Let's go. He's pumping that water out. Ooh. Now he's, he's on the move again. Torp, one torp left. Come on. Oh, my goodness. We're only green, but. He's only got a 3.5%. He's hitting us way more than we're hitting him at the moment. Most of his water's out. Same with you. Oh, come on. There we go. That's it, we should have him. We should be close. Close, 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 come on. And we'll turn as soon as they're fired, he's missed. Let's turn. Oh, he's trying to make a run. I want this to this uh, light cruiser to draw his torpedo. To be honest, if we can 
Use up that torpedo, and then we are in business. I'll turn just before. Oh, he should be firing now. Yep. gonna scout the edge and I'm hoping he will launch no. and we can out maneuver all right we're on fire to do this. Should be able to. Put all guns on target now. Here we go. Full of this heavy coming up. They're all trying to take out the light. I think we have the tail is just now he's still lining up on the other all right you're going that way Mighty close. Knocked out engine number three. Remember, he's got no torpedoes left. One more shot and we'll head back to the light cruiser. Didn't hit. Let's go support the light cruiser and try to take out.
Come on. Like he's moving towards us. No, it's holding off. Well, the battle's taking a lot longer than I thought it would take. dangerous we are now filling with water with the heavy so we might would put us in harm's way Okay, we have him damaged again. Got fire on board. So close. Pretty much dead in the water at the moment. Take a punishing, that's for sure. Okay, so we got him another shot, another shot. That's it. We need to get in with these big shots coming through now. This is as far as we've got to float 32. We've only probably filled four or five compartments and he pumps it out pretty good. So we've got a chance now if we can put another hole in him. He's pumping them two out again. That needs to run. You need to run. Again, pump them out. As you can see, quite a bit of fire, but the crew is doing a great job keeping this ship afloat, that's for sure. Let's hope he can... Still missing. We're about to hit his torpedo range. Let's scoot that.
believe this. Ship is certainly chasing. Hit him in the side there. A nice shot. Got flood him. Let's see what have we got? Three, four, five. So the same amount bulkheads flooding at the moment. We can't get it really past there. Let's... I reckon if we take out two, maybe three more. But will he take him out? That's the question. It's already pumping him out. miss and now they're pumping them out and our light cruiser is all safe over here well we wanted to protect our transport so far that's what we've done whoa that was a good one Now we've severely damaged him. And our troops are still, we're running out of shells. He's 5 inch and 2 inch, I don't think are doing anything. 9 inch hit. Severely damaged, but not what we want. We need some holes. Alright, we'll put some... Uh, go back to armor piercing. He is severely on fire. You can see 20% losses. And a 40%, so he's burning, burning away.
That's what we're talking about. Severe damage. Now we're down to it. Now we are down to 10%. Down to 6%. That is as close as we're going to get it, I think. We are down 2%. He'll pump them back out. There we go, starting to pump. We're gonna stay. He could probably launch here. There was severe damage. There we go, that's it. We got him. Okay. That is him gone. Great job, but took way, way too long. Because we're now down to 56 shells. And he's still got plenty of shells. So I don't know what we're going to do here. Is Natal going to now take us? Save on ammo at the moment. see what firepower we have with the Hertha. Let's watch. Can we land one of these shells, which are pretty much at point blank range? Yes! It's exactly what we wanted to do. And if we keep on this angle, we may be able to get off another salvo. Just move you on a bit more of an angle. That was great. He's taken out this, uh, I'm trying to take out my light. I've only got 40 shells left on this front gun. He's now totally dead in the water. This is when we want torpedoes. Which my new ships have, by the way. All my new light, heavy, Battleships coming off the line are all going to have torpedoes. So I know all of some of you out there said, you need torpedoes, you need torpedoes. They're coming. The second gun is trying to save ammo. Okay. Surprised he hasn't moved his main guns onto us yet. Or is he doing that now? Nope. This is my bait. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We just did another beautiful... Did we just get another shot? Oh, no, that's the... Oh, yeah, engine. Oh, they've repaired the engines. All right, we haven't hit yet. 7%. Because we're going to have to bug out as soon as uh, our ammo runs out. from his side. Damn. Missed again.
repaired all his engines. Wow, what a long battle for just... Compared to our last battle, which was that huge battle, we've had no chance. Well, we had a chance on that last battle, and it was over and dusted pretty quickly. All right, we're going in for a close. He's going to... It looks like he's going to try to ram us, doesn't it? But he can't get his rear guns onto us at the moment, so I'm taking the risk that we're going to hit him on these close-range run. He missed. He's still aiming. Can we get another shot off? We won't. You run, you run. Good thing. That's it. That's it. We missed again on those rear guns. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to reverse. Oh, gosh. This is dangerous now. We've just damaged our engines. Because at full speed, I went into reverse. By accident. So we can uh, fix that up quick. Six. We're out of ammo. We are out of ammo. Two shots left. And then we're bugging out. That is it. Battle over. We tried. Very lucky. We didn't have the aim. He lived to fight another day. Okay, so there we have it. We sank one ship and they sank one of ours. So a minor victory. Nothing Same. huge, nothing. Much. All right, so now we're going to skip ahead a turn. Uh, so we're still about even with the victory points. So we'll go to the next turn. British this time lost transports. But they've laid down a lot more ships. Have they had anything come? They've completed repair. We can't afford to. We are really, really struggling here, cash-wise. I really just want to get the shipyard size increased. I know I could pretty much bring some of this back because we have got a very high tech budget. But at the moment, I am happy to bleed a little more. We are now about ready. Destroyer design. Boilers, let's go and bring that up. One month we'll get a new destroyer. We have got a couple of battles. I'm going to leave it there. That at least got us ahead a little. Just a short, uh, shorter episode. Well, not too short because that battle went a lot longer than I thought, the uh, main battle. And uh, then I will uh, skip ahead. I'm going to take these battles offline and then when we come back again i'll have this battle done the next turn done and we'll go and create some new uh designs because we're going to have develops new destroyer hulls so we're going to be able to do a destroyer or complete a destroyer and then i'll go back to hull construction uh and we'll go from there all right everybody so let's go in and let's uh go to our shipyard and our next Wombat is about to come off the production line. So this bad boy is about to come off the production line. So I'm looking forward to it. 
And we do have torpedoes. I'm pretty sure we have torpedoes. We better have torpedoes. Torpedo armory. What else? Where's our where's our where's our guns? There we go. Underwater torpedo tubes. Alright. Thanks everybody. We'll leave for an overhead view of our nearly battle ready ship. So thank you everybody and again thanks for all the support if you enjoyed please hit the like button if you enjoy the content please subscribe but thank you again and uh, we'll see you all on the other side.